文化プログラムを始めていきたいと思いますはじめにサンウィラ・ドールさんはスピーチをしますのでお願いします Next, now we would like to start our cultural programs. Now I request Sambira Dole for a speech.、Uh, Sambira, please come on stage. Dear all, Jai Bhi. My name is Sambira Dole. Happy Dhamma Chakra Pravartan Din to all. Today I will share the incidents in the life of Dr. Baba Sahib Ambedkar. First incident is. When Baba Sahib was nine years old, while going to school, he always took a sitting mat with him because he did not have permission to sit inside the classroom. So he had to sit outside of the classroom on that mat. He had to take his mat with him always while going to school and returning from school. The peon of the school also did not touch his mat while cleaning the school. Even most of the teacher was not ready to teach Baba Sahib because he was born in a family of Mahar. Mahar is considered as a lower caste people. People from a lower caste did not behave good with them. They did not touch them and believed that if they touched the lower caste people, then their God will give them curse. So they called them untouchables. Another incident in the school life of Baba Sahib is that he did not have permission to drink water from a common pot in the school. So whenever he was thirsty, he must ask the peon for water. The peon serves water to Baba Sahib without touching him. The peon pours water with a certain height so, so that he could not get touched by Baba Sahib. Some or other day, if the peon was on leave, then he had to stay thirsty. One day, when peon was on leave and Baba Sahib was very thirsty, he thought he can drink water. When no one can see him, but he got and beaten up by the people in the school. They told him that no peon, no water. One more incident. When again Baba Sahib had the feeling of a, of untouchability during summer vacation, his father called him and his brother to Kolkata, where his father was working. Both the brothers reached there and by train, but as their father was busy, he could not be able to receive his boy. So Baba Sahib and his brother decided to take a bullock cart to reach his father's place. When the bullock cart was on the way, the bullock cart rider got to know that the brothers were from lower caste. So he ordered them to get down from cart when the when the brothers questioned him a lot. Then he asked for double charges to drop them, but with the condition that they must ride the cart by themselves. The cart rider follows them because he did not want to sit with him. These are some incidents which Baba Sahib suffered a lot in his childhood. That is why, even though he was born in the Hindu religion, he will not die as a Hindu. Doctor, Doctor Baba Sahib Ambedkar said that religion is for men, not men for religion. For getting human treatment, convert yourself. Convert for getting organized. Convert for becoming strong. Convert for securing equality. Convert for getting liberty. Convert so that your domestic life will be happy. Why do you remain in a religion which does not treat you as a human being? Why do you remain in a religion which prohibits you from drinking water from a public well? Why do you remain in a religion which comes in your way for getting it? Why do you remain in a religion which insults you in every step? Dear, no. A religion in which human behavior with other human is born.
for him. It is, is not a religion. Then Dr. Dr. Sahib Ambedkar said that all the religions such as Muslim, Christian, Sikh, Buddhism and Nasiru and decided to adopt Buddhism as his religion, it gave him a message of peace and equality to the entire world. On 14th October 1956, Dr. Baba Sahib Ambedkar converts into a Buddhism with his family and lacks of followers at Diksha Bhumi Nagpur. May AC Dharm Komanti Ho, Jo Swatantrata Samanta or Bhai Chara Sikhaye Jai Bheem Jai Thank you, Samira, for your support.